foul tarnished. In search of the Elden Ring. Emboldened by the flame of ambition. Forgive me. I've been testing you to see whether or not Grace truly does guide you, and whether you are fit to face the challenge that entails. It seems my worries were unfounded. Torrent had your measure from the very start, whereas I merely pretended. There is but one other thing I can do to offer you guidance. I can take you to the Round Table Hole, gathering place of tarnished champions, guided by grace. Very well. Let my hand rest upon you for but a moment. again. I'm glad you took my warning to heart. Those who live in death should be left well alone. All the more should you spy a mariner among their number. Well, well. Another fool who won't listen to reason, eh? But with a prowess for weeding death root. Hmm. How would you like to earn the strength of beasts? If you're inclined to haunt more of those who live in death, 
and weed their death route, then I'll introduce you to Garank, the beast clergyman. I have a matter of my own to attend to, and the beast himself wishes for someone to take my place. What say you? Very well. Show me your map. I've marked the location for you, of a hidden gateway. It will lead you to Garank, the beast clergyman. What is it? Still milling about? The map indicates where the gateway is hidden. It will lead you to Garank, the beast clergyman. Oh, I see you've just arrived. Welcome to the Round Table Hold. I'm Corin, a man of the cloth. I teach incantations, the strength granted us by the two fingers, and explore the secrets of the Golden Order, so that one day, if a tarnished of the Round Table Hold should become Elden Lord, I might counsel them, ensuring order regains its proper form, writing rule over men. By the way, do you still see it? The guidance of grace. You do? Wonderful news. Most tarnished are blind to it these days. You are something of a rare breed. Well, what do you say? Care to learn an incantation of the two fingers? The Golden Order shine through you. Oh, this is a rare occasion. I can't remember the last time a new Tarnished made their way to the Round Table. Very well. As your senior, I bid you welcome. It is safe here. You may let down your guard. Allow me a word of advice, as your senior. You are a mere visitor to the round table. Nothing more. A house guest. Yet to earn their keep. Remember your place, newcomer. There's nothing left to say. Be at your leisure. Hello. You must be new here. I'm... well, just call me Dialos. The honor of one's house holds little import in these lands. By the way, have you met a young woman named Lanya on your travels? She's my servant, but fickle as the wind. Take your eyes off her for but a moment and she's good as gone. If you find her, please be sure to tell me. Be sure to tell me if you meet a young woman... She's a servant to my house. She's been my companion since childhood. I've lost count of the number of times I've had to find her like this. Honestly, she's such a little tomboy. Be sure to tell me if she's a servant, she's been my companion. I've lost count of the number, honestly.
face. No matter. It's all the same. Lay out your arms. Let's get smithing. I see you've noticed the chains. Nothing special. I'm a prisoner and these are my chains. I'm trapped by the hold. I'm dying, smithing for you fools. <laughs> That's all there is to it. No, don't read too much into it. Well, no grudge against you. My being a prisoner is no fault of yours. Besides, I don't mind smithing. Despite my differences, the weapons get stronger all the same. Given time, technique never fails. Besides, it helps me forget. The sheer terror of her. Greetings, great champion called by grace. I am Fia. Circumstances have compelled my stay at the round table hold. Great champion, would you allow me to hold you? But briefly, perhaps you might share with me some of your lively vigor and your stout heartedness. Doing so will grant me the warmth of a champion. And you, I am sure, will bear a Balderkin's blessing. Do you think it vulgar, perhaps? Where I come from, it is a sacred act. Ah, my thanks, great champion. You are... Very warm. What you felt light up inside you was a Balderkin's blessing. Though it is but a fleeting thing, I am afraid. Come back to me, should you require another. I will take you in my arms as often as you need. Pleased to see you again. Would you like me to hold you once more? The blessing is still aflame in your breast, dear. Would you like to be held regardless? Now, come closer. You are so very warm. I was known as a deathbed companion. Where I come from, after I received the warmth and lively vigor from a number of champions, I lay with the remains of an exalted noble to grant him another chance at life. To do so, is the purpose of my being. But before I could bear the noble into new life, I was awakened by the guidance of grace and chased from my birthplace. Pray, be kind. Despite all that, I still wish to be a deathbed companion. So please, 
Let me hold you like this, as often as it takes. Then good day to you, my dear. Pleasure to see you. Did you give the little chrysalids the message that I love them? What do you need? I have little time to spare. Oh, are you aggrieved? At the notion you were but a visitant here? Then you would do well to remember the first words of grace given to you. Stand before the Elden Ring and become the Elden Lord. If those words held any meaning to you, follow the guidance of grace. Lay low the shard bearers and claim for yourself a great rune. Do so, and the doors to the round tables in the chamber will open, and you will receive the wisdom of the two fingers. Once the wisdom of the two fingers becomes your own, I'll impart to you a proper welcome. As a true member of the round table, I have high hopes for you. I'm sick and tired of them. These namby-pamby tarnished think us no more than a shelter from the rain. We've spoken long enough. I have matters to attend to.
What is it? Still, the map indicate will lead you. 